Hello everyone and welcome to episode 12 of Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. So we made it to Akala, I think we got the tower last episode, and the fairy fountain. Right. There's a guy walking here. Who are you? Hey! I can't seem to make the dishes I picture in my head. Blah. What happened to my inspiration? And by this I always say, nothing beats a eating a delicious meal. Uh. It not only heals your heart and soul, it can also make your heat, cold, shock, or fire resistant, or even stealthier. Dishes are the best. Thanks to cooking, I can move forward in life. I'm so glad I became a cook in this crazy world. Ha. Hey now, why don't I take a quick look at the ingredients I've gathered, eh? They're all fresh. Mm. Take a good look, every item is top of the line. Nah. Nope. Ah. Goodbye. Who are you? This isn't the one you have to climb down on, is it? Oh. Well, that kind of uh, backfired. bother with that then. Continue on what I wanted to do to this time. Except Yeah, I think I'm gonna do it. Let's get a piece of wood. And I just pass the plant. Yep. Place this on the ground right here and uh sit till morning. Oh, of course. Okay. First time we're in a uh, lightning storm. You need to equip all of your weapons that are made of metal. So like right now we need to go to that shield. We're okay on that bow. We're okay on... Wait, are we on the right one? No, we're not. I had the icon. Okay. We can switch to this bow. And maybe switch to the only good weapon... You'll be okay. Just, be, just watch out for any uh, sparks and stuff. Like that. Yeah, you quickly. Not exactly what I wanted to happen when I uh, changed time forward. Keep putting a thunderstorm. Wrong one. Let's uh, use that one. It's gonna take me on. I wanna go, yeah. This is. That one on. Well, maybe not. Maybe I'll jump. Ooh! That was close. this way. Might be safe. Oh, 
Let me in. Oh, it's golf. I guess that would be golf. Oh, we just... Really? That worked. We make it, we make it, we make it. We made it. Now, watch behind it, and there's a second golf course. Uh, this one might be a little more tougher. And I don't know if we, if it's, no, that's actually not that hard to do. It's more of just. Yeah, it's not as hard as I was thinking. There was another one like this. Or something with one behind. I think there's one with the stasis that's a lot harder. <laughs> Frost blade. I would drop it for something. Let's just drop this. Now come out, hopefully the uh, storm is over with. Yeah, storm's over with. Okay. Now, where's Beetle? He inside at the moment. Say, hey, Quest. Good morning. I'm on the patrol lately. The name's House. Jeez, it's getting dangerous around here lately. Yes. Yes. Recently, I've been hearing about a suspicious, a specific, suspicious guy named Kilton. He runs a shop called Fang and Bone. They say he goes around pushing some kind of cart night after night. He's been making people around here uncomfortable with his suspicious and otherworldly activities. Do you know Kilton? No, I don't. I see. What have you? See any suspicious people? Please tell me what they look like in detail. You see this Kilton character? Please tell me all the juicy details. I'm counting on you. So I just realized I need something to make this a little easier. Hopefully I find one just laying around here. We need a torch. Not a wooden bow. It's possible there's one up where I'm going, so. Oh, there's Beetle. Beetle! Hey. Oh, I knew I'd see you again. That technically makes you my stalker. <laughs> Seriously, I'm gonna ask you to stop following me around. Oh. Who am I kidding? I love the attention. What are you looking for? What do you got? <laughs> oh, I might have enough money for this. 
Take them all. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Uh. More arrows. I'll take this just because you got them and they're cheap. I think I need that for something later and I'm not... Nope, not enough. Now we're gonna head up this hill. Did he just fall down? Now we're out of the storm, we're gonna have to change our weapons around. Put the big weapon on, a big s that, let's put that on. That's a good weapon for what we're gonna fight in a few seconds. Now if I get up that high. Around here somewhere. It's right over there, right? Straight ahead of Link. That rock. What's behind it? up and see if anything's under it. Sometimes there's stuff under rocks. Oh, like that. 20 rupees. The Akala Ancient Tech Lab. Well, you do have a torch. I want that. Give me that. What are you? I, it, and it. Hey, you. What are you doing here? Hmm. Are you the one called Link? Yes. Hmm. Hmm. That's too bad. If you were the legendary Link, there would be something important I need to tell you. But how can I determine for certainty whether or not you are the true hero? Yes, how indeed. Hmm, yes. If you can show me your wounds your body suffered a hundred years ago, that would should prove you were truly Link. He, I think he's asking us to uh, take our clothes off. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yes, the number of skulls on your body, just as I remember. Most seem to have healed, but they do not line. They do line up with the skulls I know you got during the Great Calamity hundred years ago. Hmm. Yes, I acknowledge you as the real Link. So let's begin again. I'm the lead guardian researcher and director of the Akala Ancient Tech Lab. Doctor? Bobby! In any case, I'm really impressed that you made it all the way out here to this rather remote location. Did you perhaps meet Pora and borrow her power? I met a child. Hmm, Pura? A child? What? She really has a kid? Hmm. Or do you mean that Pura aged backwards? She is now a child. Pura got younger. Hmm. Are you certain? Hmm. So she's as crazy as ever. Okie doke. Knowing her, I'm guessing she screwed up some experiment. Mm hmm. Yes. Typical. 
Let's return to the subject at hand, hmm? Do you know that the Calamity is regaining its power? I know. Hmm, I see. Then I don't need to tell you my story. Hmm, you can tell me. Hmm, yes, I see. In that case... The goal of Oshika Research Lab is simple, really. We aim to destroy the Calamity that is a door to cross time. To rid Hyrule of all its dark influences, influence, and above all, to rescue Princess Zelda, who is now a prisoner of the Calamity. We have worked ourselves to the bone, conducting our research. For a time, I feared I would, I'd pass before we could prevail. Oh. However, you, Link, managed to awaken before this old sack of flesh gave out. That means, the time is now. Hmm, yes, yes. You, now is the, the time to join forces with us, Sheikah. Yes. We must destroy the calamity. Let's do it. Oh. Yes, that is correct. You and I are going to join forces to put an end to the Calamity. On that note, sorry for the long preamble, but I'd like to provide you with some ancient soldier gear. Mm-hmm, did you catch all that? <coughs> Cherry, mm, the ancient oven, creates the... creates ancient shoulder, shoulder, soldier gear. But I fear she's out of sorts at the moment. Hmm, I'm afraid someone will have to bring the blue flame from the ancient furnace again. I'll close back on this time. Let's leave. Go do what he needs. Blue flame is, I believe, over in this direction. Thank you. Mount like on the opposite side here. That's where it is. There it is. <laughs> so we need to fly over that way. Oh, I got a new sword. A <laughs> replacement for one for the one he broke. Made me break. So, get the torch out. Here we go again. Lighting these things again. I believe you can take a little shortcut going this way since we've got the. Uh, they don't slide here. Not really a shortcut, it's just a. Uh, can we go this way? I don't remember. I think we can. Be careful not to slide too much. No, no, out of my way. I need to put this down. Really? Here to make it easier. I need to go about here. Just so I go the right direction. Oop. 
Who's shooting at me? Oh, you. Can you leave me alone? Oh, I can take his arrow. So let's head toward this direction, because I believe there's somebody that wants this at the stable. Since we got a torch, it make it a lot easier to just walk over to it. As long as those uh, wolves don't bother us. Find the lantern here and I believe somebody's sitting right beside it that wants it. That wants to see it. With you. Ah, good old blue flame. It's so soothing to stare at, don't you think? Don't put it out. I don't want it. I need to go this way. And now I can get rid of this uh, thing on the map. Now we can just go straight up. I'm afraid to pick those up because I'm afraid it's going to just pop up and say, put my light out. I'd like to get close to a uh, lantern. Just for like insurance. Akala Ancient Tech Lab has been added to your map as a travel gate. Let me put that away. Oh ho! You, Link. Listen up. Hmm. My darling Cherry is back to normal. Such is the power of love. My love made Cherry well again. The forest is lit. Oh. Well, thank you. Yes, quite. Now then. Please say this is a gift of my gratitude now that Cherry is fixed. For ancient arrows. They are made using secret Chica technology. With the addition of my upgrades, they have morphed into ancient calamity weapons. So to speak. Needless to say, they are an incredibly powerful type of ancient soldier gear. I like to call them ancient arrows. In addition to the ancient arrows, Cherry can make all kinds of ancient soldier gear. If you're looking to acquire some, Give your ancient materials and rupees to Ch Harry. Rupees? Did you hear that? Ah, forgive me, Link. Ever since the fall of Hyrule Castle, we haven't had much in the way of funds for our research. That's why I thought you might be willing to help us out with rupees. Lots of them. I beg of you. Then let's do it, hmm? The two of us. As soon as possible, yes. Let's conquer the calamity. Hmm. Let's go see what Cherry has. Hey, hey, beep. Familiar name missing. It's not materials and rupees. So. so we got ancient arrows, weapons, a 
and I would like these, but I don't have the cores or anything yet. See time. Come again. Plop. Familiar name missing. You have something for us. Hi. Good day. And hey. check it out. How was that? I figured I'd give you an impression of Hatino Ancient Tech Labs Director Pure a shot. Maybe it was a bit maybe it was a bit much for the first time meeting you though. <laughs> Link, don't worry about it. It's all okay. So, what do you need from me? They had Okay, whatever. Gotta go. I saw you with a red thing earlier. Oh, I'm not gonna bother with it. So now I got this done. The list of rupees are just getting higher and higher. What? Is that just a campfire? Yeah. Okay. So, where should I go next? Go back to my horse. <sighs> should I go this way or should I go over on the other side this way? Hmm. Hmm. I'm trying to think which what area I want to go in next. This is Central High Wall. Eh, let's go do this one. So we're gonna have to head toward them. Yeah, toward this. Oh, don't tell me it's not. You're not the one, are you? Hi. Good evening. You're stopping by Foothills Stable. Then you're probably headed for Goron City. That's right. Mm. I thought so. Hold on, buddy. Are you really headed to Goron City dressed like that? Yeah. See, that's how tourists get a bad rep. This place is, that place is a sheer cliff after sheer cliff. And it gets so hot past the second checkpoint that your body will catch fire. Normally I wouldn't stop a stranger from heading to the doom, but I kind of like it. Mm. So I guess I have no choice to, but to sell you these fireproof elixirs. They can protect you from the burning air. Even go and say regulars usually take at least three elixirs with them. It's 60 for one, 110 for two, 150 for three. Buying in bulk pays off here. I think I'm gonna just buy one. All right, here's your fire fireproof elixir. Six minutes and 10 seconds, ah. that should be enough. You know what they say though, hope for the best, prepare for the worst. Beat, beetle. Maybe I will go buy a second one, just in case. Uh, can you pass you? I really don't think I need a second one. Beetle. Okay. Wow. What? You came to see me. Again. That makes Beetle so happy. But don't get the wrong idea now. Beetle's heart belongs to Hyrule. What are you looking for? What are you selling? Look what I got. Oh. I gotta figure out how to make a little more money, which I should have probably just... I'll sell one of these, that'll be enough. Yay! Show sure, bought in bulk, but oh well. Yeah. Okay, I've already talked to this already. One. Okay, you go. Go on, city. Should be this way. Yeah, 
take it up higher, it's gonna make it a little easier. What's that thing? Yeah, that's the way I need to go, actually. <laughs> The lizard you stupid thing. I need a lot of those lizards, so I'm kinda gonna be looking for them as we go. It's kinda why I say I don't really need two fireproof elixirs. See, stealth and one, two puts us at four because I bought two earlier. Just keep following the trail. Seeing the lizards as we go. Danners, Donners. Uh, forgot about that. Oh well. I can see another lizard over here. I'll get the lizard before I deal with those guys. Spears. Oh, he one hit me too. Oh no, what are you one hit me? These things are about useless at the moment. We've got into a fire and that thing just catches on fire, so. Let's keep going. Although... It is night time, I don't want to deal with those guys again, so... Better meat from this board. Of course, it's a higher graded board. Got a whole board. Uh, somehow got two whole boards out of one. Let's go this way.
Close to the fire. Stop that, Bounce. Uh, stop that, Snickers. Eh, eh. Don't chew on the rug. Lay down. Regional map extract. Okay, so basically, we just skipped all this. So we need to head in this direction because I believe where I want to head is literally right here. Or is it follow up? No, that's actually the city. Okay. So what I want to head to should be right here. Yeah. Which is this direction. So now that we've jumped off head this way, now we need the elixir. Also we have a weapon that's going to catch on fire. Uh, a bow. Here we go. We need to find a metal bow at some point. That's not good. Nearby. We have some wonderful winds. Oh well. I want this thing forced, if you can't see me. Get away with a bomb and throw it at him. You eat it? 
Blow him up. That's how I do it, at least. Shoot him with an arrow if you wanted to. This is what we up to now. Six. Okay, so we don't need more. At least where I'm headed is gonna have a bunch of them there. Just speed up the process if I find the lizards on the way. Or I find some ores. Money! That's what's nice about coming here. Ores are everywhere! felt too uh, odd here okay so what we gotta do is I don't have a bow that's gonna survive here let's get out of here just ignore him and just keep on going because if I need a bow get rid of his eye uh, fire but without uh, without the ability to bring the bow out without catching on fire we're kind of stuck He was following us too. It's all here now, that's good. Ooh, poor board. Okay, so. There will be uh, lizards around here. Which we're going to go get. Like, right there. We need to find more. That should have been number seven. That'd be number eight. That'll be more money. Another one which puts us at nine. There's a few more here and I'll grab both three of these. A southern mine. So now I gotta find the guy that sells it. It's gonna be a random person here. Here he is. Oh hey, perfect! You showed up at just the right time. I'm on my way back from Goan City, but forgot to buy souvenirs. I wanted to capture some of those fireproof lizards that live here on Death Mountain, but those suckers are quick. Say, you look pretty speedy. I bet you could catch a ton. You bring me ten, I'll even give you some heat-resistant armor. So what do you say, buddy? Help a pal out of a pal out of a jam by capturing me some fireproof lizards? Leave it to me. Ah, oh, great! Thanks, buddy. Just ten fireproof lizards should be enough. You can probably find some right around here. Buddy, oh I got them. Wow, look at all the fireproof lizards. You have actually managed to chase down ten of those suckers. Well, deal's a deal. Hand them over, and I'll give you this heat-resistant armor. Here you go. Ah. Thanks, buddy. Here, take this. The Flame Breaker Armor. Oh. Hmm? Something the matter, buddy? Oh. My helmet? Sorry, it ain't for lending. It's too expensive for that. You can buy your own in Goan City. To get to Goan City, head north from here. It's the fifth stop up the trail. Ah. I'm sure you'd agree, buddy, that it's always handy to have some spare souvenirs on hand. So if you've come across any more fireproof lizards, I'll buy, buy them off you at 20 rupees for three. And if I get my hands on some fireproof lizards and some monster parts, I can make some fireproof elixirs to boot. Mm -hmm. well, that's good for you. Now, oh, that's right here. This makes it where we don't need fireproof elixir anymore. So I'm going to end it here and we're going to continue our, pat, our walk up there. So, this time we'll go up the path. Bye.